Hi and welcome to my channel. I'm uh, Dr. Marcus Spry. I'm a dentist in the UK and I post a new dental related video every Monday. So if you'd like to subscribe and hit that bell, ding, be grateful and you will have first view of the new video. Thank you. Hi and welcome. Today's uh, video is looking at this product here which is uh, bright black uh, charcoal powder, teeth, tooth whitening and I'll be giving you some uh, advice and opinion on this little here product. See what you think. Okay, so we're going to look at um, an activated charcoal uh, product for whitening the teeth. And the first thing that we need to say, I mean, obviously this is a model of the teeth here, but there are two fundamental discolorations of the teeth, and dentists call them intrinsic and extrinsic and the intrinsic ones are the fundamental color of your tooth in the tooth and the extrinsic are stains and discolorations that occur on the surface of the tooth okay now fundamentally and this might come as a bit of a disappointment to you but this product is not going to whiten the intrinsic aspect of the tooth color it cannot do that and anyone that says it can is lying okay it just doesn't do that but it doesn't mean to say that it's completely without uh, some use because it definitely will uh, smooth off uh, the extrinsic staining so surface staining things like uh, coffee and tea and red wine and uh, and certain foods and what have you and smoking can can cause a, a discoloration on the surface and this will definitely work one of the things that um, charcoal powders uh, have the effect of producing is whitening by the fact that when we put the black on the teeth actually look whiter as a result of the contrast of the black okay there's zero scientific evidence that it actually gets into the tooth and makes it any whiter you can do that but you need to have the teeth professionally whitened with uh, hydrogen peroxide products please go and see your dentist and, and that, get that sorted out. Okay, so if you have a look at the color of the teeth as, as they are now, if we put some of this, um, it's a, quite a messy product, so we have to be just a bit careful with this. I'll get my toothbrush. So the, way, the way to, best way to do it is if you just wet your toothbrush a little bit, okay, and then you can pick some of the product up, you can see there, okay. And then when we put it onto the model and we start to clean the tooth, you can see what a mess it makes. I, I can't I can't imagine a more messy product if I was to try all right so what will happen is that you get this effect in your mouth okay all right so it gets absolutely everywhere what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna give this a bit of a wipe okay pop that down there and you'll see straight away that the teeth now these teeth cannot get any whiter because they're just made of plastic but they now look whiter because of the contrast to the black, okay? And that's what will happen in your mouth, all right? So the effect is an illusion entirely because of the black to the white, okay? But it definitely does, the activated charcoal definitely does remove some of the surface staining, okay? But here's my thinking, so does regular toothpaste. So is regular toothpaste this messy? No, look, <laughs> look, look. look. I've got a really messy hand now and I've got carbon everywhere. But um, the fact of the matter is, is that you could just use a regular toothpaste to, to do that. So I can't say that it's my favorite product, but it's very popular. And I think that it would be absolutely true to say that it does clean the surface of the teeth and it will give you an, a sort of an illusion of it being whiter. But if you really want your teeth whitened, I'm afraid it's off to the dentist with you and uh, you'll need to have some proper professional tooth whitening. Um, and you won't get that at all with uh, charcoal uh, products, I'm afraid. Okay, so there it is. It, uh, it will clean the surface, but it won't get into the inner workings of the tooth, which hydrogen peroxide gel would. So have some fun and don't wear a white shirt or blouse when you, when you do your brushing with this because you'll definitely have a, a black shirt or blouse instead. Okay, thanks for listening. Please like, share and subscribe. Click on these boxes for more of my videos for a smile for life.